Hey everyone, what is going on guys? So guys, welcome back to Ark Survival Evolved. Guys, we are back today. Probably as you can tell, we're playing on a totally different map. Wait, what's down there? I've, never, I've actually never been under this water before. So guys, a lot of things have changed by the title. You can see that my tribe is recruiting right now, which I'll explain in a little bit. How you guys can get yourself in the tribe and come play with me. I will also explain why we decided to reform the tribe and go to a different server. But guys, in the meantime, let me explain what's going on right now. So guys, basically we moved servers. We actually found one last night that only had 16 people on it, and now all of a sudden today it has 70, and the lag is terrible. But anyway, I'm not sure exactly how that happened, but that's kind of what we got stuck with. So now we're in a server with 70 people that have four days of building a ahead of us. There's no tri trilobites. Right now I'm looking around for trilobites so I can get spenting paste, but I have not found anything at all. I haven't, I haven't even bothered looking for beaver dams just because, you know, people are going to find those already. Those will already be taken. Now, we've never taken my tribe on a server with this many people before, so I'm not sure exactly what to expect or how it's going to go. But we'll see. It should be a lot of fun. We should get a lot of fun PvP stuff out of it. Our base... Oh, go try the bites right there. I get, I get so distracted by this. Look at, look at this. Yes. Yes. Why aren't you dying? You need to die. Oh, that's amazing. That's amazing. All right. I'm gonna kill these guys first, then we'll harvest them. Are you dead? Oh, you're dead. You're dead. Okay, let's go up to this guy. Whoa, this lag is so bad. It must be lagging because of the amount of players on the server. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, dude. How you at? You're level five. Look at that chitin we're getting. That's perfect. That's exactly what we needed. Like, for real. Look at the chitin he's got from those five right there, guys. That's so amazing. That's exactly what we needed. All right, let's see if we can find any more. Because basically, we already have a spot picked out where we want to build that's kind of off the map. Uh, we're hoping people don't find it right away. At least give us, a, give us a chance to get, you know, some bolts and stuff up and get somewhat defended to get some more teams. But it, it's not our final build destination. We have one more spot that we really want to build in, but we need a lot of material to actually do it. So we're hopefully this spot can keep us pretty well protected as we build up. And the spot we're moving to is actually a metal spawn like 50 yards away, so it's really close. Because right now we're actually living off of a raft, and the raft, I mean, it's, it's doing its purpose. We have like five or six guys on right now, which is including me, and basically they've been just taming birds and stuff and getting stuff around. Alright guys, so we are almost to the raft, so our goal, at least for tonight, our goal is we have to get everything built up for the base location. Now the base we're about to build isn't going to be huge, but it should be effective. It should be very easy to defend and everything. Oh, whoa, 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 what the hell? Oh my god. This lag is so shitty. This needs to stop. Alright, bird, come here. You have everything on you. Where'd you go? Bird, turn around. Come here. Come here. Alright, so no, we're gonna pull this metal out of the forges right now, too, that we can. So we might as well start getting some more metal structures built up that we need. Alright, here we go. Put that in there. As you can see we got some structures made up. We gotta get some more sprinting pace though, which is gonna take a little bit of time. So I know some of you are probably wondering, you know, why would I quit my own server? It's not necessarily I quit the server, but I just wanted to avoid the whole, well, you're an admin, so you must be cheating thing. Now I do have admin logging on on the server, guys, so anything I did with commands, everyone on the server could see. But I still just wanted to avoid the whole thing because I don't want people to think that I cheat because I don't. But no matter what you do, if you're an admin on a server and you start raiding people or even play, they always accuse you of cheating, no matter what you do. But guys, my server will be wiping actually in a day or two here. So if you guys are looking for a server where no big tribes are allowed, the max tribe limit is actually six, then definitely check it out. We're going to switch it to the center map, I believe, this time around and mess with the mods a little bit. But it should be a lot of fun. I won't be playing on it this time around, but I still will be on doing all of the fun admin stuff, you know, like getting rid of old bases that are raided or doing server updates and all that fun stuff. Last time around, guys, we actually had like 20 people on almost at all times for the first week, week and a half. And I have added some new rules because what happened was there was one tribe that was going around just killing everyone. Not necessarily like killing them off fresh spawn, but killing like off their teams and stuff from just flying around and stuff like that, which is part of the game, and I don't want to take that away. But we are guys going to add a few rules to the server just to help some lower level players and new players get started off so they can't be raided right away. We also will be adding some new mods to the server as well that people want as plus, so we're going to have it. So guys, my classes started this past week. I actually have homework to do after this video is done recording. Um, and I have an, I'm taking this networking class right now, not a networking class, which I, I always talk about because I always have to take them for my degree. But it's really hard, and I don't know what to do because I'm having some issues. It's an online class. 
and I'm trying my best in the class, you know, and that's, that's all you can do in, in school is always try your best, and that's what I'm doing. I'm trying to understand everything that's going on, and it's just, it's, it's pretty hard, but I think, I think I'll get through it. So guys, right now we're flying to our t other temporary base location, we're actually going to have a base and some uh, actual defenses up and everything. And I'm trying to get there right now, and we, we, we chose this location because you can only get your flyers, which is the big thing, because we, don't, we won't have anything else besides flyers for quite a while. And it's really close to a metal spawn as well, too. And we're actually right on top of one. And I don't think people are really going to find us out here unless they come out to the edge of the map. All right, guys. So here is our location right here, which I said it's not big. It's not big, but it should be effective still. And right there, guys, where those trees are right there, right where the nose of my bird's point in, that is where all the metal is right now, metal and crystal. So we're really close to it. So we're going to build right here, and hopefully this works out pretty well. Alright, so there is the little outline of this base. Like I said, it's not going to be big. I might, honestly, you know what, I think we'll go one more out though. So once I get more metal, I'll have to do that. But what we're going to do is we're going to put the dino gate on the back side of it. Oh, S+, plus. what are you doing? What, what are you, what is this? What, what is happening? Why is it doing this? Hello, game? Perfect. I'll put you right there. That's perfect. It's trying to snap in, I guess. Alright, so here is the start of our base, guys. So all we need, we need two more metal foundations and just get these walls up to match with the dinosaur gateway. Get some ceilings and we can start working on some sentries as well, too. That's going to be a big must-have for sure. We're actually, we're going to have to go one more up from that, aren't we? Yes, we are. Alright. Alright, so we're going to head back to base right now. So here's the start of our base, guys, as you can see. We won't have a lot of room to work with, like I mentioned, but it should be okay. Because we're, all we're going to have over here are birds. Argy's in... Uh, probably pterodons right now. But we should have room to keep them around, hopefully. I hope. And if I decide to expand one more out, I can pick up these walls anyway, which we might just do anyway. Alright, so anyway, let's fly back to base now and get some more metal stuff crafted. Alright guys, so I took a little bit of a break. I, I stopped recording and we just got the grind going to get the base up and done. Now, it's made, it's pretty much done. We actually have the actual building up itself. I'll show you guys when we get back there right now. Guys, we're actually going to grab some Plan X seed. Basically, our job now is just to get this thing as fortified and defendable as possible because this is going to be like our base of operations, basically. Like, even if we're able to get to the point where we can get our actual base up, we'll probably keep this one because it's so close to a metal spawn. We can get metal so fast over here. All right, here we are. We just got to the swamp. So let's see if we can't find any of the plant X little species things, little plants that just kind of chill around here somewhere. Where are they at? Where, where are they at? I don't see anything. We gotta be careful of those nasty crocs too. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Nothing. Okay. Let's keep trying, I guess. And still nothing. Okay, there's just not a thing here. What is going on? Hello, game? I know they're around here somewhere. Come on. There's a raft in here. Okay, wait, wait. Oh, here, oh, here we go, right here. We, we found one. We got one. All right, let's get some seeds off this guy. All right, we got more than enough seeds. Probably more than we're ever actually gonna actually use. So let's go get some more organic polymer while we're out here too, just so we can stock up on it before tomorrow when everyone gets back on. I think right now, I think there's like 25 people on. It's been a few hours since I was recording last. And earlier when I was recording, there was completely 70, like fully maxed out on the server. So guys, if you want to join this tribe, guys, all you have to do is go check out my Discord group, guys. And all you have to do on the Discord group, it's very simple. There's a, a recruitment chat. All you have to do is answer the few basic questions. If you don't see the, the questions that are asked, click the little pin button in the top right corner. Because the questions will be pinned there, guys. Now guys, there's actually not a lot of questions you actually have to answer. They're kind of just simple and kind of random questions. But all you have to do is answer those questions for me, guys, and also leave your Steam profile links. So when we're able to get to you guys, we can send you guys a Steam invite so you guys can join the server and we'll invite you that way. Now once we're more established, if we can get to that point on the, such a high populated server, I will release the server to everyone. It's just that we're trying not to draw too much attention right now. I think the best thing about our base location, besides it being like pretty much off the map, like you can only get here for the flyers, but... We're so close to metal, like doing metal runs is nothing right now for us, which is so good. That's why I really think even if we get to the point where we can actually move to the spot we want to move to, I really feel like we're still going to have this base here just to, just to get metal because it's just so convenient how close it is. 
All right, guys, so here is the base right now. This is what we just got up tonight since we've been on the server. As you can see, it's all metal right now. We can come inside the store here so we can get flyers in here pretty easily. We have our beds. We have all the basic stuff you would need. The cabling liner looks a little, a little weird right now, but it's like that because we're not done with it yet. So once we're all done with it, they'll all be hidden. Now, if we come up here... or sorry, Wait, 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 wait. Gotta grab the rest of these bullets I made. All right, now if we come up here... So up here, guys, is the hatch frame to the top of the base. As you can see, we only have two sentries right now, which I know isn't a ton, but that's all I was able to get up right now. But I think the base overall is looking pretty good. We've got more birds up here. Our raft is actually like that direction out in the water still, just in case something happens. We always have a backup plan, and we still have a few birds over there as well, too, along with a frog and some other things. So, guys, let me show you where we get metal from. If we come right over here... This is where we get all our metal. We can now get crystal, stone, flint, wood. Everything can be right here. Look at this, guys. No, not all the spawns are here. I've already been over here a while ago hitting all the spawns. But it's just crazy. Like, we have, like, our own personal metal spawn. And the lag's just terrific, too. Can you imagine if, like, if we get an ankle over here? It's going to be crazy how much metal an ankle can get off these things. Basically, what I do, guys, is after I get my metal, let's go from there right back to base. That's how close it is. It's just crazy. Like, once we have, like, a weight RG and stuff, we can really start packing the weight and just carry everything at once over here, not to make multiple trips. So as I do have to say, I am very worried about us being raided off this server. This server, there's no ORP, which is very interesting, which means people can offline raid like crazy. Now for us, it's gonna be really hard when we raid people to know if they're online or not, and which it will be an issue, obviously. But I'm hoping that we can hopefully get some good raids off this server before we get hit. Which eventually we will get hit. I guess the Alpha Tribe's pretty aggressive from what I've been told. Or kind of one of the alphas, you know, the people, one of the tribes fighting for alpha. So guys, I gotta say, it's been a few days since I uploaded that Rust video, which I was very nervous about. I honestly, I didn't expect the Rust video to get over 100 views, but guys, you have just made me so happy. It's got over 300 views right now, which is just crazy to me, because like, I wasn't expecting that. Like, this channel is built around ARK, which I'm fine with, you know, I, I love ARK. ARK's a very fun game. But if you guys watched my video from, from yesterday about my one year on YouTube, I mentioned how I was very worried that this channel might only be seen as an ARK channel and nothing else. But I'm very glad that you guys are wanting to see me play other games. Now, another game, guys, you will see in the future is Subnautica. Now, I know some of you guys are actually very excited for that. I am, too, because we're going to start right from the beginning. You know, I've, I know there's a bunch of new stuff added, and a bunch of YouTubers have been covering that, but we're going to start our journey right from the beginning of it, and it should be a lot of fun. So, guys, I do plan on uploading other content than ARK, so, and I'm glad you guys want to see it. It should be a lot of fun. This channel will probably still be mainly ARK content. Um, I'll probably do a few ARC videos and then some video that's not ARC. Since we are getting back to daily uploads now, I'm actually getting ahead now. I can actually get on a schedule and actually have an upload schedule for you guys. So it's not uploading late at night, early in the morning for some of you. So everyone, guys, thank you so much for watching. This has been ARC Survival Evolved, guys, on the brand new server. Again, if you want to come play with me, be in my videos, guys, definitely join the Discord group and let me know there. And I will definitely get you guys in the tribe. It should be a lot of fun. We're accepting everyone right now. So I think go in that recruitment chat again, guys, and post your stuff there, answer my questions, post your Steam profile, and I'll get back to you guys as soon as I possibly can. So I want to thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, hit, make sure to hit that like button, guys. Let's go for 30 likes on this video. I know you guys can do it. And I hope all of you guys are having a really awesome day. So I will see all of you in the next video.